So I'm looking at uh, the C tutorial. The first I'll start with uh, storage classes. Storage classes define scope, visibility, lifetime, material, and function within C program. Therefore, called storage, uh, you have auto register static extern. Auto is the default storage class for all. For example, if I do it in some storage class, auto can be used with function. Register storage class. Register is used to define local variables that should be stored in a register instead of RAM. This means that every has a maximum size equal to register size, usually one word. And uh, uh, can't have unary operation applied to it, so the so does not have memory allocation, so you have register. Register should be used for variables that require quick access, such as counter. They should also be rotated and defined as not to be that the variables be stored in register. It means that might be stored in depending on the hardware priority restriction. So registers are fast memory, they are faster than RAM. If you remember, it's something called the L1, L2, L3 cache. So the rest. Then you have static. Static is default for both the variables count and static storage. Static variable can be seen with all function. Uh, at time, the static variable defined here will not be seen by object module. Static can also be defined as a function at one of them. So static int count. Static also is a function. Note here keyword void means does not return anything, it does not take anything. Definition versus declaration before using, let's understand the difference between definition and declaration. Definition means uh, what a variable function is defined in reality, actually memory is located. Declaration means giving variable function is defined somewhere else, the program will be for that type of uh, liquid. In the above example, cat star home has been put at the top of which is declaration function. There is one more use for static. Then you have extern. Extern is used to give reference of global variable that is visible to all. Uh, when you use extern, the variable cannot be initialized as it is a point of variable. When you have multiple files and you define a global variable function that will be used as a file too. Also, extern will be used for another file to give reference of defined variable. Just understanding extern is used to declare a global variable function rather than file. So that was the storage classes. So auto register, static, and extern. Static and extern. Uh, uh, are tricky one. Now, what are control statement? Control statement are if, if expression or, if else, if else, if expression statement if block of element, if else and else f is f. We have operator. Was the default condition looping? So while for for single element but expression 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 here, do while so do while is just like while except and is checked at the end of the loop rather than starting this is effect that control or will executed at least once break continue exit from loop or switch continue to skip so include main intj for i equal to zero j equal to j plus plus if i is equal to five continue print f hello So break would be used to break the statement. So these are all called control statement. So input and output. <coughs> so printf, scanf are two uh, most uh, basic functions used in C. I enter December file character string is equal to ABC character string is equal to S float by printf. Uh, just observe uh, what we are printing. So string character float. So integer is by D, string by string. Uh, then F, then C. So uh, D is being used for integer, S is being used for string, F is used to print a float, S is used to print a character. So what is the difference between character and string? Uh, we'll look at that. S is string, B, character. So this is character. This is string. Then you have scanf slash d would be used to read an integer passing and to store the value. Operator f at scanf. Pointing to data. Pointer and array, character star y, character x and red, y is equal to <coughs> address of x0, y equal to x. Then 
<coughs> using arithmetic array. What if I'm using that? Then we have using function playing with string. This is important. So reading and writing string. Char string copy, copy string into destination string. Char string copy, string n copy. Character first n string. Compare string compare n string copy n string copy. String n compare string length string cat string n cat string car string r car. <coughs> string 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 talk reverse the string so these are so big out with string in all there are 11 12 numbers now we have data types so a structure in c is a collection of items of different types you can think structure as a record in pascal or a class in java without method structure or structure very useful in getting data larger complex Simply you can group variable data type into structure. So structure student, character first time render, character, character SSN float type. Okay, now you have a data type called student. So, so struct student, student A, student B. Or struct student, student 50. Struct uh, character first name, student A, student B. So you can declare it like many ways. Struct example. Pointer to struct <coughs> reference with in in fetch operator types of keyword. You can create struct. Struct cannot be compared. Struct can be compared into function. So this was about tutor point C.